Are you ready to build a brand new home and you want to discover the hottest, the most popular communities here in Sarasota to build in? Well, today we are gonna explore five communities that you're gonna fall in love with. And we're starting right now with Sky Ranch. Taylor Morrison has created a community that is ideal for all ages. Whether you're eight or 80, you are going to fall in love with Sky Ranch, which is located right off of State Road 72 in Sarasota. And this location is key as State Road 72 is also Clark Road, which leads right into Siesta Key. So as you can see, you're about a 20 minute drive from this neighborhood community to Siesta Key Beach, which is really a big deal. As so many people talk about wanting to be close to the beaches, and that's why they moved to this area. It's for the sunshine, for the warm weather, for activities, and for our beach lovers. So let's talk a little bit more about Sky Ranch and why I think it's so popular. First of all, it is divided into two separate communities. Well, actually multiple communities, I should say, but specifically Casilla and Esplanade. And again, if you know Taylor Morrison and you know Esplanade, you know that what an Esplanade is, is an active lifestyle community. So this side of Sky Ranch is really for the little bit older population and it features a number of single family and villas and a variety of sizes, shapes, styles of homes. Some of the most popular floor plans such as the Farnese, the Palazzo, or all in the Esplanade at Sky Ranch. This area also has their own amenities, which has resort pools, pickleball, beautiful little clubhouse. It's very ideal for this part of Sky Ranch. However, the other side of Sky Ranch, the larger homes, the more two-story homes, the more sprawling ranches of Casilla, well, in the heart of this area is a state-of-an-art amenity center like none other we see around here. Think a uh, rock climbing wall, indoor basketball court, culinary center, fitness center, so much to do, not to mention an amazing swimming pool, zero clearance walk-in, it's just ideal. Now that clubhouse has not opened yet and is scheduled to open early 2024. However, the Esplanade side has just opened, so for residents on that side, they can enjoy this beautiful warm winter days. So some other great features about Sky Ranch is that along with the amenities, there's also a playground, there are soccer fields, there are baseball fields, and directly across from Sky Ranch, we now will have a K through eight elementary school, which is currently under construction and slated right outside the gates of Sky Ranch. So as you can see, there is so much happening at Sky Ranch. Currently, it is a little further away from some shopping and amenities, but I know that's gonna change very soon. And if you can see, in what is coming, you are going to love Sky Ranch. As I said, there are so many different floor plans out there and perfect for all age ranges. So be sure to put Sky Ranch on the top of your list for locations. Remember, my team and I help so many people buy, sell, and invest in real estate, specifically new construction here in Sarasota and Manatee counties. So if you'd like more information, give us a call today and be sure to subscribe and keep watching for more valuable information. Also check us out on Instagram and TikTok. All right, let's move on to the next hot community here in Sarasota. And this is Talon Preserve. Nestled in a picturesque part of Sarasota County, right off of State Road 681 is Talon Preserve by DeVosta Builders. Now this is luxury living as well. And one of the key factors is location. I specifically love this location for multiple reasons. First of all, you're a little bit outside of all the hustle and bustle and all the crazy traffic that does come with living in Sarasota specifically right now. But you're also close to so many things, specifically Nokomis Beach, which is about a 12 minute drive door to door. You can be sitting out on the beach in no time. Also Publix is just down the road, probably about five minutes. And for nature lovers, you're going to be close to Oscar Shearer State Park. You're going to be close to the Legacy Trail for bikers, joggers, 
all of that. There's beautiful landscaped walking trails in the community. The community is full of a variety of homes and Devasta Homes are building a variety from small villas that are about 1,600 square feet all the way up to 3,000 square foot sprawling ranches. So there is something for everyone. Their amenity center did just recently open. And again, this is one feature that people are really, really looking for when they're paying higher HOA fees is a sense of community. And that's what you're going to find in Talon Preserve. They have a bar and restaurant, which is very popular. They have a full-time activities director. And I know recently they just had an art fair that came out to the area. They have live entertainment that they're bringing out. So they're really bringing in a sense of community to Talon Preserve. This is a gated subdivision and there will be a total of 926 homes when this is complete. So if you're looking for a convenient location with variety of styles of homes, you're a nature lover and you want to be a little bit out of the rat race of all the traffic, Talon Preserve is definitely something to add to your list. Let's move on to another beautiful subdivision, and this is Artistry by Coulter Homes. Artistry is located off of Palmer Boulevard and Lorraine Road, and this is a very key to understand and know, as Lorraine Road will be running north and south through Lakewood Ranch, through Sarasota, all the way to the south to Nokomis, which is going to be wonderful as you're not going to have to jump on Interstate 75 and fight that traffic to get to Lakewood Ranch. Also in this area, the culture is building beautiful homes. What is really special about artistry is that 90% of the lots in this subdivision have a water view and a preserve view. All of the homes are 2,400 to over 3,000 square feet. There's a little bit more customization that you can do with a Coulter built home as opposed to say a Taylor Morrison or even Devasta. So this feels a little bit more personal when you're designing the home. There is so much you can do with your home. Now, if you want a pool, they do add pools as well. And again, not all builders are allowing you to add a pool through the construction process. But with Coulter at Artistry, you can do that. Also, if you're a golf enthusiast, this is also a very special location as there are a number of courses within five or 10 minutes of Artistry. Also, Tatum Elementary School is literally just down Palmer Boulevard. It's five, 10 minutes away for families or those that have children in school. And also the other thing I love about Artistry, although it is east of 75, Palmer Boulevard runs to Cattleman Road, which Cattleman will connect you to Bee Ridge. It's gonna connect you to Fruitville, making it very, very easy to get downtown, to get out to the beaches. So you can see there's a lot to love about Artistry. I definitely um, would put that on your list. And also currently Cardell Homes, are now building a few homes out at Artistry as well. So this is a great neighborhood and there's only 160 home sites at Artistry. So it's going fast. It won't take long before this subdivision is going to be sold out. So now's the time to get in. So let me know what you think about Artistry or Coulter Homes. I'd love to hear your feedback. I've heard some good and bad about Coulter lately, but I think that for the location, the size of homes and just the amenities out there that this is a great location so again love to hear from you all right let's move on to one of the communities that Neil Holmes is building which is Grand Park Grand Park is a beautiful meal community and again here we have state-of-the-art amenities now if you're somebody that is not looking for a lot of amenities or paying high HOA fees then stick around until the end because my last subdivision has much, much lower HOA fees, but was still having some community features. Let's talk a little bit more about Neil Homes. Now, I love a Neil Home. I think a quality builder is a little bit above some of the other builders that we see. I think they are very well appointed homes. And this location is very close to Twin Lakes recreation facilities. So for soccer players, for baseball players, 
it's right there. Also, it's located right off of Ibis Road, off of State Road 72. So again, for beach lovers, you can jump on 72 Clark Road and head to the beaches or jump on the interstate and get to University Town Center very quickly for shopping, dining, entertainment. But this is, is tucked away a little bit further off of a main road. So if you like privacy, you like quiet, you love nature, this is another area that's going to have all of that. And they have villas. So if you're looking for a small 1500 square foot villa, they have those. If you want a 3200 square foot ranch style home, that's available at Grand Park. Or if you're looking for a two story home, they have a few models that fit that as well. So there's a lot to love out at Grand Park. So I definitely, again, think this is a community in Sarasota worth checking out. Let's wrap it up real quick here with the final community on my list and a brand new community that will be breaking ground in 2024. And the last one is Palmero by Taylor Morrison. This is all about location. First of all, it's a smaller community with just a few hundred homes and the amenities, they still have a pool, they have a basketball court, they have volleyball, but you don't have high HOAs. They have single family homes, two story ranch and townhomes, which a lot of people like. Actually, their townhomes are almost completely sold out. So for affordability, this is a great area. Also, this is key here. This is located off of State Road 681, just minutes to Nokomis in Venice. This is a two minute drive to your local Publix, which is just down the road for shopping. There's the Dunkin' Donuts, there's a little restaurants. There's a lot that are just two minutes away from Palmero. You are minutes away from Oscar Shearer State Park. So for nature lovers, again, this is a great location. And today I drove this, it was six minutes to Nokomis Beach. And Nokomis Beach is one of my favorite local beaches. It's not as crowded, there's not as much traffic, you can get in and off the island a little bit easier. If you're a boater, there's a marina right there that's convenient. You can jump on the intercoastal, get out to the Gulf very, very easily. So Palmero is a fantastic newer neighborhood. But also, found out today, Taylor Morrison is creating a sister neighborhood to this called Tiburon and Tiburon only has 80 lots. They're going to be very low HOA fees as the amenities, again, will just be a pool, maybe a pickleball court. The lot sizes are larger, so there's gonna be some very nice sized homes out in Tiburon. And this is located off of Honore, just south of Allen Preserve. So in these 80 lots that Tiburon is gonna have, as I said, they're going to have 52 and 62 feet lots. So there's going to be some that will be able to feature three car garages. You're going to be just minutes to Venice. So again, very, very convenient location. As you can see, there's a lot coming around Sarasota and Nokomis area. Actually, Nokomis is booming as well. And there's so many new communities coming to our area. So be sure to continue to watch. And if you want to hear about the latest communities, be sure to watch this video, the 10 newest communities coming to our area in 2024. If we can be of any help, just give me a call today, shoot me a message. As I said, my team and I sell a lot of new construction. So if you have questions about builders, about the process, be sure to keep following along and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and until next time, take care.